Hello, my name is Lee Coleman from Hughes and Coleman Injury Lawyers. Today I want to talk to you about five signs of nursing home abuse and what to look for when visiting a loved one in a Lexington nursing home. The first category would be bed sores. Bed sores are pressure sores, pressure ulcers is a name for it, and they occur when uh, someone is allowed to lie in the bed without being moved and turned regularly, without being inspected. They can happen and be treated. If they're not treated, they can get very bad down to the bone. Check the body and just look for primarily in the back, the feet, the sacral area are the most prominent for, for these injuries. Be looking for those. Broken bones occur in falls. Falls should not happen. Uh, so if your loved one experiences a broken bone, that is a sign of abuse or neglect. Dehydration. Many of these patients in nursing homes rely on the staff to make sure they get enough liquid. It's a constant job and not pr providing proper hydration can lead to serious medical problems. So be watching and making sure of that. Malnutrition, it is what it, it, it sounds like. If they are not getting enough food, if they can't feed themselves, it is up to the staff to make sure they get proper food intake. Malnutrition, starvation, unfortunately, is all too common in a nursing home. The final category I would point to is bruises. And while bruises themselves are not enough to really support a, a, a case in court probably, they can be an indication of a lack of care that mean you should look into other things. If you see bruises, maybe there are broken bones, maybe there are something else. So pay attention to significant bruising uh, and follow up on that. If you suspect that your loved one has been abused or neglected in a nursing home, our dedicated nursing home legal team is here to help. Take back control and call us today at 800-800-4600. And for more helpful tips, subscribe to our YouTube channel.